all right guys so i'm just going to be here talking about the new atd update and what do they have and the, and meanwhile i'm gonna beat the new map snow day in master mode already because i'm a professional gamer you know you know i'm a professional gamer. so let's see oh god my throat Anyway, so so there are a few things. Firstly, um, we have uh, food item, which basically in a nutshell is basically like temporary buffs. So these buffs can be stuff like dark force, which gives you one random extra tower, which is seven towers in the game for river. Okay. And then after that, we also have stuff like starting height is five hundred more, a thousand more. And the two times that that's right, I know, which basically gives you like some cash, like one thousand, like two thousand five hundred cash every fifteen weeks. So there are a few ways to get it. One is the more accessible way is just log in every week. that you after you play the first match, you get one free scratch ticket. However, that's only one time. You know, I get it permanently and get you know you gain two tickets much more accessible. Keep the bonds much more accessible. You. You buy scratch tickets for 300 gold each so that you can, well, basically buy the scratch ticket. It's like RNG, you know, you love RNG, I guess. And you could get some rare ones or common ones. Um, There are a few ways to get it free, however. Like I said, the first way is to basically win your first Arena Tower Defense match. So you could just go into an easy game, eat it, win, very easy. There we go. And, and after that, there are other ways to get it for free. One way is to join the Arena Dev Group, which is basically your Roblox group player. If you join that, you can have fun with Roblox, take Roblox or food coupon every single day. Oh, uh, basically a scratch ticket. Sorry, my bad. It's a scratch ticket. So that means you open it and click what the food coupon is. Next two ways, the other the other two ways are basically becoming a premium user and a new IP user. There'll be separate roles to give it, that will be given to them after when you're premium the party, and you can gain one free ticket as well as a day each. So theoretically, you can gain three free tickets one ticket every day. Which is nice. I appreciate it. It's very nice, you know. Take note, however. That it doesn't apply to regions that are random to Python. Players in those regions can only buy such tickets to regions to Python. It's kind of not a separate thing. Okay. Uh, we have a new map, Snow Day. We have Ice Cuba. Ice Cuba is the one who made this map. It's the wonderful map to the Okay. However, this map is easy. I'm going to destroy it in master mode. Right now, you're going to watch me do it very well. Oh yeah, this text over there, this is where I'm going to run. This is a... Uh, this is a... Uh, let me find it. It's a rich text, I guess. It basically like, kind of bolts a text or something. Oh no. We have a new login environment. Now it makes the like, hybrid cafe it's more of a resort of Canada. Um, okay. <laughs> I definitely live there now. Event inventory UI, you guys should be able to see in game, it's very useful. And in this UI, there's also stuff like tower UI, like tower career viewing, where basically you can see stats on stuff like how long have you used, like when do you buy it, or I think it's not, and how many times you chase the tower, like how much energy to dial, etc. Something like that, you know. And obviously, how many games you want to do. I bet that thing. I haven't checked my time. But that's like roughly what the tower will be with the best. We have quite animations and could be an unusual key for the eventual UI. I'll talk about that. But it's interesting. We have two quite high years now and two alert series. So it's not crowded. Only profile cards can now be favorited so that they are the top of the list so that you can go and scroll down all the way in number to choose your favorite. We, the sibling bummer is now back in the street crash shop. You guys must have missed her. The big youngster. 
we also have the optimized server performance in games. So now, the server performance in games is way much better now. It's way better in the future. We also have exclusive mail letters, such as um, achieving your first victory, having your best to new subscription, owning the VIP system card, and also open the All right. And also, definitely, the game 40 days in the world. You definitely don't know about this. We wrote the mail letter for playing the game for our first time, and we think how do you watch the world? We watched the game for our I don't remember that many days in the world. I never had it. So, thank you, I guess, because I don't know. But I guess it's going to be back to the world with other people who don't know about that. So, yeah. Um, we have a new new tape, right? I'm going to check it out later. Not now. It's called Experiment, right? So basically, in my what happens is that experimental is basically like um, master mode. Right. So basically, it's like master mode. I said instead of just master mode, it's basically just um, like kind of um, like you have access to all files in the game. And in, except for the fact that Guardians, you only, you only can choose one Guardian to bring. So that's interesting. We have and we have some stuff now. Balance changes. Because new in developer mode. With the new UI navigation, newer players will struggle to find the first power to use. So then the main stuff you know, and those are comparable factors in the background, things get more straightforward to use. So basically in my story that I got um south of power that but in order to make it more accessible. So then we can choose the class, the browser. It's kind of like the size thing, you know, and then like that. Okay. So because of that, in the shop, both to monetize this from 3,500 XP to 1,000 XP, and this is what price decreased from 3,000 XP to 750 XP. That is way more affordable. And after that, I am not so sure about that because the only thing I'm not so sure is how swordsman is target price than wizard. My god, wizard is much more useful. <laughs> okay, next. Balance changes, even more balance changes, except in the game sets. We have Ayaka. Ayaka's imprisonment ability damage value has increased, so she can do more damage with her ability now. Hikari. Hikari's the base price decreased from 1850 pounds to 1550, so she got the choice. Damage increased overall and can give more buff damage. If EAP base time time um, has increased from 1 second to 1.5, which is good, I guess it's good. Radiance of EAP increased overall and EAP enemy aggressive damage increased overall as well. So if you don't know what EAP is, it's kind of like plus time. An enemy aggressive damage is basically something like um, if you place three towers near the party, the party will do more damage. Because in the law, the party hates the beach. So obviously, she'll be more aggressive. So then she'll be more aggressive and she will do more damage because she's not dead. Even though she's in the If that's the record. Hyper drive ability has increased from 25 seconds to 30 seconds. This seems good. But however, the ability cooldown also increased from 60 seconds to 70. Okay, I guess that's not that bad. Honestly. It's longer, but I think it's not bad. Right? Recap. This is the one I'm very, very much excited about. The attack speed increase overall, so you have more chance to start. The range increase overall, so you have more chance to start. And level speed also increased as well. It means it has a level up faster. So it may be like, whoa, whoa, whoa okay, that's that's good and all that. But I do find it's not that bad, right? Especially if I'm not for no reason, I do some bad, right? Wow, I feel like she might be very good now, right? 50 chronicles, I'll get transcended very bad, which will basically stop fire mage for rain, for damage. for damage. And um, a time speed for wizard. And finally, the ability. This is what I feel like I'm playing to be tough, right? 
and this might be a huge weight for the so I guess it's the, I, I guess I'll pretend to record it, I was really comfy there using Vika for ancient Greek master notes. So what happened? Well, um, a beauty of level 7 is called Tempest Rest. Tempest Rest, for short period of time, tells the way of the book, will be able to have their basic cooldowns go down off there by two times. Two times faster. That's insane. And also, Fire Mage ability to reset. So, Fire Mage right over there, you know the triple ability? The one which is actually the like honestly the best ability you ever have in the after note. It 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 resets instantly. I'm tempted to use it now in the note because of it. So that is generally it for um that is generally it for update. So if you like, please enjoy the rest of the gameplay. Have a nice day.